Hi everybody, my name is Massimo Banzi and I'm the co-founder of Arduino and I'm here today with Davide Gomba who is the CEO of Officine Arduino in Turin and we are here to talk to tell you about a special announcement. Yeah, Massimo, what's going to happen on the 29th of March? <laughs> so the 29th of March uh, we have organized this worldwide event called Arduino Day where Basically, we are asking local Arduino communities to organize this one-day event about Arduino. It's essentially a small self-organized conference where people get together and they get to know each other and they share what they're working on, they share projects they built with Arduino. And the idea is really for local community to have an excuse to get together. Also because it's, uh, we start this March essentially one year of celebration that lead up to the next Arduino day, where it's going to be 10 years that we started using the name Arduino. So we started working on Arduino in 2004, but we picked the name Arduino in 2005. Yeah, how do people enroll in the event? How can they organize uh, and host an Arduino day? So there is a website called arduinoday.tv, uh, also available as uh, day.arduino.cc which is where you can download a kit of digital files that you can print out and make a poster, make flyers, make your daily schedule, there's instructions on how to organize the event. And, um, and also we're, um, uh, we have a map where people can apply to, to organize the event, be placed on the map. And actually the other thing is, um, the, the groups that become part of the Arduino Day, they get a, they get a discount. They get a 10% discount on the Arduino online store. Well, cool. So they have all sorts of flyers, posters, and goodies to Arduinize their place. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, it's a completely self-organized thing. So we provide these um, materials based on the Arduino community logo. And then we ask people to just, you know, organize it the way they prefer and, and uh, really get people from a certain area together. Yeah, certain areas. Where, where are the main Arduino events? I mean, is there anybody already on that map? So we are discussing with some friends in China to organize one in Shenzhen. So there's going to be one in Rome, which is going to be organized by you. Yeah. <laughs> and then... Uh, Yes, and I am going to be in New York. So these are the sort of events. Um, so in New York, we're going to be at the ITP, which is this uh, school within um, uh, NYU, where Tom Igo teaches, which is one of the founders of Arduino. And it's always been a place that's been very sort of close to us. And we spend time there when we are in New York. So, and uh, but then the evening of that particular Saturday, I'm also going to be on Ask an Engineer, the online show organized by Adafruit, which is going to be essentially the closure of the sort of daily activities. That's on at 10 p.m. Uh, New York time. Cool. So we also have an, an hashtag, so everybody can look for it on any social network, which is Arduino D14. And uh, see you in, there is a counter on the site, 38 days up now. Yeah, it's important that if you guys use the hashtag, it's easy for us to find the materials because we really want to publish through our online channels all the information and the pictures and everything that people are doing during that particular day. So keep us informed, post, share. I mean, this event is essentially, you know, uh, it's an excuse to get people together to have one day where all over the world people organize events around uh, their own local Arduino community and they get together with other Arduino enthusiasts and they form connections and bonds and I think it, this is going to be cool. Nice one. So see you guys and uh, happy birthday Arduino. <laughs> Thank you and please join the Arduino Day 2014. Bye bye.